Hi, and welcome to Cryptobiography. I'm your host, Brandon Starr. This is episode 386 of Cryptobiography, and I'm calling this one 500. And the reason I'm calling it 500 is because this coming Wednesday is going to be the 500th episode of my other podcast, the Utini Cast. So we've been doing that for, uh, gosh, so now it's been like almost 13 years. I think it's actually it's over 13 years now. Anyway, a long time. We did it uh, weekly for a while and then um, every other week for a while. So uh, that's why the math is kind of weird on that one. Um, but yeah, very excited to, to do it. It's actually going to be an interview of some of the SWOTOR developers, which we're very uh, excited to reveal. Uh, more about it later. You can watch the, if you're if you also listen to Utini, Utini Cast. You can um, you know we'll, we'll be posting all over social media as as much as we can about it, and that's going to be coming up on Wednesday. We're gonna what we're gonna end up doing is we're gonna do uh, episode 500 as just the interview by itself, and then um, we will uh, then we will um kind of stop the stream very brief, briefly, restart it, and that'll be episode 501. So we'll be doing them in the same night, uh, but we're going to do the episode 500. That's going to be the dev interview by itself, and then it's going to be 501, which is kind of a normal episode, more or less, although we'll also be talking about the interview, so that'll be kind of special too. And we'll give out some codes and stuff like that for sure too. That's gonna It's going to be a lot of fun. But... Um, yeah, because of that, uh, I had a lot of mental energy going into that episode because we did the interview, um, started working on editing and so on, and um, yeah, it's a lot. So uh, we, uh, I did not write this week, uh, fiction-wise, uh, and as a, as you as you know, the last episode was the wrap up of the repercussions, the last story. And so I have some ideas of what I'm going to be writing, but I haven't actually started writing yet. And in fact, yeah, I, I still probably need to do some more thinking to make sure I sort of have things dialed in before I even start writing. So I'm, I'm but I am planning on sort of like dig, digging down and going into it. So I'm, there's going to be a lot about the episode 500 up through Wednesday that's going to keep me busy as well. But I really do want to get some writing done on this as well and get going on the next story. So... Anyway, um, yeah, very excited. Um, I suppose it's because I've been very consistent with cryptobiography. Um, at some point, we'll actually pass them up. We'll pass up UtiniCast because, you know, th that there's only one being added every other week. But that's still a long ways off. So um, I guess it would be somewhere around, episode, since this is close to 400, they're at 500, but they're also adding one every other w week. This one is adding one every week. So I guess around episode 700 of the Utini cast, something like that, a little bit more than that, 720, something like that, uh, will be, yeah, CryptoBioFu will have caught up. I'm not too worried about that. It's just kind of a weird feeling. Anyway, uh, so that is that. Um, yeah, if, you, if you're if you seeing this, um, thank you for listening to CryptoBiography as well. I really do enjoy writing the stories, um, trying different genres. I definitely feel like I have sort of a style, like even though I, I write in different genres, I, I'm pretty sure that someone, if they like saw different, you know, different stories of mine, uh, they would probably be able to tell it was the same writer. Like I definitely have a style sort of developing, which is kind of a cool thing. Um, but yeah, but it's fun to, to try different, you know, somewhat different genres and stuff. And anyway, so thank you for listening to Crypto Biography. If you're a new TDCast listener, thank you for listening to that as well. Swotor is still a hell of a lot of fun. I do stream every day, uh, doing, usually doing, well, almost always doing Swotor. Actually, I haven't streamed anything else for oh, at least over a year. So, I mean, at this point, it basically is a Swotor stream as well. And um, that's at twitch.tv slash chillsroom. And, but yeah. Thank you for listening. Um, yeah, and like I said, it's one of those weeks where just something else just wildly took over, you know, my, my not just my time, but also my, like, my mental space. Like, I was thinking about that constantly, and because not only did we have to do a bunch of work to get ready for it in ahead of time, but then on the day, that was, day was, you know, completely busy, and then uh, since then, I've also been, like, working on, like, uh, 
getting uh, you know social media and, and so on, getting the marketing going, so to speak. Anyway, it's been a lot of fun, but uh, I do hope that I can do some uh, good writing this week and have the first part of a story for next week for you. So thank you for listening. Uh, if you have any comments or questions about this episode or previous episode, cryptobiography at gmail.com or hit us up on Facebook. Um, I'm getting more and more away from Twitter slash X for reasons which I hope are obvious, uh, but I am starting up. Um, I did add, uh, we've had a Mastodon for a while. Um, I am now doing Blue Sky. Uh, I still mostly do it on my personal account, but we do have, uh, uh, we have a new TeenyCast one on Blue Sky, and I guess I'll add a cryptobiography one as well. Anyway, um, yeah, so it's usually Brandon L. Star is usually where you can find me on various social media. Um, so you can always contact me that way if you can't if you if you, there doesn't have to be cryptobiography yet on the on your preferred uh, um, platform. Uh, but thank you for listening. Uh, Words of Music copyright 2024, I guess. Uh, <laughs> if, uh, uh, characters and events are fictional, fictionalized, or satirical, which I always say even on these non-fiction ones, which is kind of funny. Anyway, thank you for listening, and have a good one.